Hello everyone, this is Harlan Bospisros, Senior Technical Analyst here at IronFX Global, bringing you today's technical updates. Today, let's see Euro Dollar, which uh, managed to overcome the support line of 131.85, and WTI, which confirmed my concerns and moved above its near term downtrend line. So let's begin with uh, Euro Dollar. After a period of consolidation above the 130. 185 barrier. The bears took control and managed to drive the battle below that obstacle. As I said in previous comments, I would expect such a break to set the stage for extensions towards our next support area of 131, defined by the lows of the 6th of September 2013, also near the lower boundary of the blue channel connecting the lows and the highs on the daily chart. As long as uh, the rate is still trading within that channel at below both the 50 and the 200 day moving averages, I will keep seeing a negative overall picture. My only concern is that on the 4 hour chart we still have positive divergence between the RSI and the price action, which suggests that the recent downside momentum is uh, decelerating. Now let's continue with WTI. WTI moved higher yesterday as expected, breaking above the near-term blue downtrend line. The RSI moved above its uh, 50 line after the rebound from its prior resistance line. While the MACD already above its signal line entered its positive territory, crossed above its zero line. Taking all these technical signs into consideration, I would expect WTI to continue higher and to challenge the resistance obstacle of 95.35 which lies near the 23.6% retracement level of the decline from the 23rd of July until the 19th of August. A clear move above that line is likely to confirm the upside bias and trigger extensions towards our next resistance hurdle of 96.70, which is the 38.2% retracement level of the aforementioned downtrend. On the daily chart, the 14-day RSI moved higher after exiting its oversold field while the MACD moved above its trigger line, supporting my view that we may see the price moving higher, at least for a test near the barrier of 95.35. So that's it for today. For more analysis and charts, please read the full comment on ironfx.com. You can also follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or circle us on Google Plus to get more trading ideas. This is Haralan Bospisros, Senior Technical Analyst at IronFX Global, wishing you solid trading.